Hello guys, welcome once again. In the last video, I have shown you how to install MySQL Server on your Ubuntu Linux operating system. Now in this video, I will show you how to install MySQL Workbench on your Ubuntu Linux operating system. With the help of this uh, Ubuntu Workbench, you have the graphical interface to uh, query your database and you will be able to manage your database much more easily than you would be able to uh, do it with command prompt so let's get started and how let's see how we can install ubuntu workbench or mysql workbench i beg your pardon so open your terminal and just write uh, this command on your terminal write sudo apt that get apt dash get install mysql dash workbench and click enter and it will ask for your password of your operating system so I will give my password and press enter and it starts installing your MySQL workbench if you want to download it then write Y and press enter and this can take about a minute to install So once you are done with your installation, you can just go to your user dashboard here and click it. And here you can uh, type MySQL. and you will be able to see this mysql workbench so uh, first of all uh, if you want to use this mysql frequently just select this mysql workbench and drag and drop in your dashboard here okay now just double click this mysql workbench and it starts opening your MySQL workbench here and once it starts you can just start uh, querying your database and managing your database when you go here at the top tab you can just go to database and click query database and you can see your configurations here all the configurations and you can click OK and it asks for your password so whenever you have installed MySQL server on your system which I have shown you in the last video you have also given your password so it MySQL server asks for your password so you have already set your password so the, just give the same password here so I gave my same password which I have given while I was installing MySQL server and I will click OK and if you want to just save your password just click this and click OK and now your MySQL workbench is ready to use so you can here you can see you can create a new schema and new databases from here so that's it for this video please keep watching these videos and please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now